There's hundreds of people who have showed up here in support of Max Public House and their owners, and they're not just supporting this bar. They say they're trying to support all small business owners who have been shut down by the COVID-19 restrictions here in New York City. I'm going to step out just so you can see just how many people are here on the scene right now. They've shut down Lincoln Avenue here uh, on Staten Island. We're in Grand City, and they say that many of these small business owners have been forced to close their doors or are still fighting to stay open because these restrictions are arbitrary in their opinion. Now, in Grand City is one of the orange zones uh, designated by Governor Cuomo in New York State, where bars and restaurants are forced uh, to shut down during this pandemic. Now, the irony is that Max Public House would have been allowed to reopen today for takeout and outdoor dining, but they say that's just not enough to get by and support their families, and that's what they're trying to do by reopening and fighting these restrictions. We spoke to the lawyer for the two owners earlier this evening. Frightened they might lose their business, they are frightened they might lose their livelihood. Here's the ironic part. These guys opened two months before the, the pandemic started. They spent $150,000 establishing this place. Two months later, it had to close down. They honored all the governor and mayor's orders. There's no reason for it to be closed when the big stores are open. Why is Costco open, the supermarkets, the malls? Why, why are the sheriff's department not standing in front of those big stores? Can somebody answer that? Yeah, and it's not just the big stores that they're concerned about. Uh, as we've seen so many times with these color-coded zone restrictions, we can actually see a restaurant just down the block here that is allowed to open for indoor dining because it's not considered the orange zone. So these people out here, the small business owners, the customers of Max Public House say that they are going to be out here and fight until they get some help from the state, local, and federal government so that they can stay open and protect their families. Of course, we'll have plenty more on this coming up tonight on the Pix 11 news at 10 but for now reporting live in grand city on staten island joe masiri pix 11 news